not working. All right. Oh man, how does this get tied to this? Yeah, I think most of this I'm just gonna do the basics today. Did you press the button? You probably did press the button, didn't you? Mm. Yeah. The wife is on it. the wrong button. That's the wrong button right there. Let's do this one is the one I want. Yep. Yep. And we're going to click this share button. Where is that share button? This share button. Share to feed. <laughs> Live. From the lair. <laughs> From the lair. Live they are. Eliane in their basement, which is less tax deductible <laughs> than what's believed. No, no, no. Okay. <laughs> Posting so slowly. Man, already Scott was in the house. Nice. Here, I'm going to love my own damn feed. Yeah, I can do it. Mm. Both hands. Now you... Oh, whoa. Oh, from the live there. From the there live there. are the in the basement. Must be Wednesday. Mm. I can put it here on Rob's open mics. Man, I do have to figure out like exactly the perfect thing between posting too much and too little, which is posting just the right amount. Yeah, and I just don't know how to do that. Because you get restricted if you post oh, too much. Sh- I would never. I have been. But not recently. No. I just I just don't know what the balance is. Tip Rocket Brigade. Yeah, let's put it in there. Do, 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 All right. All right. And see the musical distance that need to hear from me today. Tacoma Park, you know, care. Try steak. Live music. Yeah, sure. We'll try hard. But to gong. What's this, Maryland music scene? Yeah, I'm part of that. And how about... Oh, the Maryland music scene. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay, cool, cool. There, I got that one. David E. Eisner. I'll put myself Hello, right Paul on. Mischler. <gasps> Paul Mischler. You're in, you're in Jersey, right? Is I'm he? actually going to drive up to New Jersey tomorrow. Are we? To visit my mom. Yeah, mom. Maryland we'll music scene. Nah, I'm not going to put one there. Oh, it's a central music, <laughs> uh, Mike's music calendar. Nah, Mike doesn't care. West Town community. Nah, it's too close to home. Oh, the Greater Frederick music scene. Yeah, we can part it and be part of that tonight. There's all these guys with beards in the um, Greater Frederick pages <laughs> recently I, the, for advertising battles of the bands and stuff like that. So I figure I should be more like part of that because there's a lot of beards. DC DIY shows. Yep, we're close enough to DC and we sure are DIY. <laughs> Whoa, posting. Okay, well, Paul, we will be in Princeton briefly tomorrow, but I, I don't know. We'll, we're making any side trips, but uh, oh, oh, mm, yeah. mm-hmm. music streaming we'll collective. Run up ninety five tomorrow. Part of that. Oh, ninety five. You can suck. My- Whoa. <laughs> Maybe feeling sassy today. Yeah. What well, I've been dead to the, dead to the world all all day. I'm trying to recover. Yeah, we'll be. Probably talking a lot about our tax angst today. Angst. Surely not. There's a lot of angst going angst. on right now. Eh, it could be worse. Kristen Jones, are you? I, is what? this one of those days where I'm going to be? You're going to be like embarrassed by me. <laughs> Only time will tell. <laughs> okay, Thomas Sweet Ice Cream in Princeton. What? Know, we might need ice cream. Mm. Thank you for the recommendation. 
Oh, that we don't need ice cream before we have to be in the car for a long time, right? Yeah. Well, you know, Kristen Jones, <laughs> you reap what you sow. Oh, comments are big. Okay. Is that what you want? Oh, it's fine. It's fine. It's easier to see. Right. Just about time, just about time, just about time. Okay. Making it go. Hello, hello. Hello, Clay. <laughs> I hope everyone had a lovely eclipse, whether yeah. you participated in the eclipse or just mooned your friends. I don't think Irene could. I don't, I don't think it got over to, oh, right, to right, Europe right. at all. Yeah. But uh, we had fun with our... 90% totality or coverage that, you know, made the light weird, but it wasn't dark. And yeah. Made big Cheshire grins every which where. Yeah. Boom, boom, boom. It made the bees be quiet that yeah, were all the buzzing. the birds all were like, ah, and the bees were like, mm, bye. And it was weird because it was like from minute to minute, you know, that uh, our friend Amy has an amazing bee bush and... Uh, and it was just the most bees I'd, I've seen in forever. And then all of a sudden they were just gone. Mm. You kind of wonder where they got off to. Yeah, I heard it was cloudy in a lot of places. We had some clouds that made, made, it, made it interesting. Like, there were times where I know you're not supposed to look at it directly, but there was enough cl cloud cover to, or right. let, let our phones. Yeah, let our friends um, like, really register. It was really Yeah, cool. take, take photos. Cool. Oh. Hey EJD, thanks. You're you're always always so nice to let us know what's going on. <laughs> but yeah, we're we're punchy today because we've been uh, in tax hell all day trying to figure out if we can take the home energy tax credit. If any of our fans out there are accountants and can help us with this question. I've done my own taxes for a billion <laughs> years, and if there's two things that I discovered will f screw up your taxes. It's getting married and buying a house. Yeah. And uh, in the last decade, I have foolishly gotten married and then bought a house. <laughs> Just everything went to hell. Hi -ya. Yeah, but we're get going to get some of that rage out through music. Oh, but first I wanted to play um, an Easter sh song that I'd missed. An Easter song. Well, I mean a rabbit song. Oh. Oh, the rabbit song we know. Yeah. I would not what? spring a song that you don't know on you more than three to four times a night, <laughs> and certainly not as the first song of the night. Oh, my God. Who do you think you married? I am not unkind. Oh, but it's too 
Hoes were full of rage and he came flagging Flagging from so high It was a great day Much greater than you might think The heat was too much They all dropped, you couldn't take the heat And the rabbits dropped like rabbits And you know they dropped like flies But we kept them coming uh, We kept them coming uh. The rabbit took too long. Satisfaction was guaranteed. They marched too long. They starved too long. They left the rabbit to the dead. They were lying rotting on their sides. They all left their skulls. They still lie that. They still lie that. They still lie that. They still lie that. They still I'm bare, it's too much to bear. I fear I hear we are falling through. We are watching, yeah. We are watching with our bright pink eyes. Our bright pink eyes are well off. Frightened beyond belief, it had no mind. The rabbit brought itself to bear. His white and I, we burn the tower down. We burn the tower down. Burn the tower down. Hey, Mark Rooney. Yeah, you made it just in time. <laughs> Let's give him a second rabbit song while we're here. Oh, okay. And uh, you can let Krista know I'm wearing her favorite zombie rabbit shirt today, too. I'm just in that mood. Just in that mood. Let me just check one thing. I want to make sure. That okay. He's going to check one thing. Let me check one thing. Welcome, everybody. It's just Rob and I this week. Um, we've had some amazing special guests the last couple weeks uh, who like even provided charts for us for their songs, and that was really cool, but it's also good to just <gasps> not have to think. Let me play a song play, that <laughs> play I songs know. Play songs that yeah. we know. Oh, yeah. Blister is bled. 
no one is listening, so no one is fed up. They got fans purchasing the falls, gotta dig. Saddle down deep to all you see is what you're dead. I gotta have an allergy to the world today. It's the only way to explicate what's been crossing my head. Now by now we march, and by man we conquer. Rabbit army rises, a raging armor. We march, man by man we conquer Rabbit army rises, a raging armor All this scratching has been getting me nowhere All this scratching is just a little rabbit cough Well, thick skin blisters and the, the blister is soft Digging heart and spas and the feeling falls right off Saddle taught me all of everything that it ought to Saddle from his vision most efficiently I gotta have an allergy to feeling anything at all today I gotta have a thick skin, thick skin, thick skin, thick, thick, thick Well, now, well, now we march And by man we conquer Rabbit army rises Raging armor Now, by now we march And by man we conquer Rabbit army rises Someone was whining about the price of gas today Someone was whining about their twin SUVs yesterday Well, I'm a man 11 Someone caught solidarity Gave love, gave blood, gave cash, gave thanks Nine twenty-three, suffering back to normal. See, he blamed Hussein, the gays, and the gas tax. Right, that makes sense to me. All this bitching has been getting me nowhere. All this rubbing has been getting me high. Shouldn't be coming as any great thing. <laughs> My thick skin is thinning, yeah. The blisters bleed. Breaking me in, oh, that's messed on swiftly. Breaking me down, that could take some time. Breaking out somewhere, well, that's what I've been thinking. Getting them quickly, never crossed my mind. Mile by mile, we march. Man by man, we conquer. Rabbit army rises, reaching armor. Now, now, now we march, man by man we conquer. Rabbit army rises, reaching armor. you to turn me up in the monitor anyway but good god if that's your volume <laughs> all right we're making some adjustments making some adjustments so you can hear all the things and we can hear all the things hey jay keating how you doing out there hello carrie on twitch thank you for being with us yet again yet again <laughs> you know, we have a request to relearn that Vote for uh, up from the rich and he gave to the poor. He championed singer songwriters and he gave, gave them, them what, what for. for. Oh, and the refrain. The hero of Northern Virginia. Saw okay, yeah. The man they called Jay. <laughs> We'll have to work that out. Okay. Hmm, <laughs> that would amuse me greatly. Jay, I don't know. I don't know if you're a Firefly fan, but if you are, we'll uh, we'll make make you up your own version of it. <laughs> uh, Tycho-fying allergy. Okay. 
Well, we'll just have to collaborate again. I had to take my first allergy meds of the season. Mm -hmm. Well, actually, like back in February. But uh, again, just just today, just yesterday, I went out to my car and I was like, hmm, what is this fine yellow powder? Someone has been doing the um, turmeric cocaine (laughs) off my Saturn. (laughs) And I said to myself, I'm curious. I'm interested. And I snorted it and I said, my God, no, man, this is tree pollen. And... um, Trees took root oaks out of my nostrils. Um, and so I took my Zyrtec, and the Zyrtec has released the white blood cells to my nose directly, where they have been pruning dramatically the oak seed where it had um, gotten all up in there. Hmm. <laughs> I hate it. I don't suffer from allergies continuously, but every every so often. I want to give a shout out to Heather Arby Lloyd. She just rolled into Susan's where uh, yeah. huh, Roscoe Bino was laying in wait. Whoa. Roscoe surprise. There's nothing quite like a Roscoe surprise. There'll yeah. be no expectations here. <laughs> and, um, and Heather has been suffering her first allergies in the last year or so. It means that she has finally molted into her adult form. And uh, Now, I know she got some getting... relief from that when she was out west. Is it starting oh, again? I'm sure because it's going to be starting again because she's coming east. back. Built on the ashes of rats, you can grind them underfoot if you wish. And thanks for the warning, but I think I'll stay. I sit back and spawn and stare at it all. A curtain and breeze, it blocks me. I turn away from the window. As you turn over sleeping, you're catching light in a different way. It seems I spend so much time just facing this wall. I don't know what I suppose this wall should do. There are dreams of saints in the city waiting. There are dreams of strength. Dreams of something that. Foot if you wish, and I think the warning that I think I gotta stand here. Yeah. I sit back and scroll and stare at the stars. You too much, I just stare at the ceiling. With my hand on your back, with that feeling. Did I stand too firm? Did I stand too tall? Did I listen to you? Did I listen to you at all? North Ave is awesome. Cast the dump when the shoot stops. I'm free to let the dog eat dog, but on the floor. We hoped and we prayed. We prayed for something better.
I stand too tall? Did I listen to you? Did I listen to you at all? Bear claw dreams of saints in the city waiting. Bear claw dreams of strength. She dreams of something better. Yeah, she dreams of something better. Oh, oh. Yeah, she dreams of something better. Yeah, she dreams of something better. No, no, no. Uh, well, it's it's functioning musically again. Oh, I, I, I I missed a couple. <laughs> this is a song called uh, Bear Claws Mule, an older song. Is that that was that was one of your products of secure working uh, security way back at MICA? Yeah, I um. So I did a uh, a film shoot this past weekend in Bolton Hill. Bolton Hill is where Maryland Institute College of Art lies in wait for you all. And uh, I don't know that I've really spent that much time there in the last two decades since I went to college there, which, hey, wife, I'm old. I'm so sorry. I didn't mean to reveal that unto I'm thee. almost uh, as old as you. I know, but I think, I think, I think you thought that you, I was all youthful and crap. But um, so anyways, I'm wandering around Bolton Hill because I'd gone to this church that actually I used to break into the garden of. Uh, we would we would break into the garden and we'd go and hang out and just it was a peaceful place to be at three in the morning, and um, and so it was really cool to go back and sort of be invited into the space and keep that thought to myself about my past activities. And to be clear, we didn't vandalize anything. We just we climbed fences. So I don't think that's breaking in. That's sneaking in. We snuck in. So I'm at this church, and uh, the mandolin quartet that I'm supposed to film is running late including my contact person for the church. And so I'm just sort of like looking around and the door was opened and inviting and they're breaking up after their service and they're wandering around and this woman approaches me as I'm looking at the front of the church up at the um, the altar and everything like that. There's this really beautiful painting up behind it. Very typical Jesus. I'm, nope, nope, this one's definitely uh, an Aryan Jesus. And um, he's up there and he's like looking distraught about his circumstances, nine inch nails and all that crap. <laughs> Neither here nor there. So anyways, I'm, I'm looking at the painting and I'm looking at things and this woman comes up to me and she says, can you believe they want to take that down? And I was like, oh, I'm sorry to hear that. They're changing things up. Well, I'm sure, you know, I'm sure. And she's like, well, you know, for some people, he's a little too white. And I was like, uh, where is this going to go? And she says, but you know, we're really all the same color when you've got that much radiance coming down to you in the sight of God. And um, I'm looking at her and I'm looking at that and I'm thinking, do I want to get out of this? How is this about to roll? How much longer is it going to be before the classical quart uh, quartet's going to be here and I can have an excuse to be here that doesn't involve talking to this woman? She said, I let them have a piece of my mind. They want to change that to a black Jesus. And really there's no place, in, you know, and I know we're in Baltimore, but... <laughs> And I was like, oh, my goodness. And wow. I said, well, you know, I've always found it fascinating that churches are communities and communities evolve. And that's one of the most beautiful things about communities is, you know, and, and you can go with your community. Or, And she said, well, you know, we're going to have another meeting about it. And I hope that you'll join us and, and that, you know, what did it up? And she's like, can you imagine if they changed it to that painting over there? And I looked around and the church had a lot of these very different interpretations of, you know, the dude myth and um <laughs> and i was like huh and i excused myself and i walked out of the church um because i just was not interested in furthering this conversation so anywho 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 <laughs> i i took that as an opportunity to just sort of walk around a little bit it was really really lovely um i know that would be a miracle and then he didn't die of sunburn 
<laughs> our, our musical and artistic life lets us encounter all kinds of unrelated but related situations anywho, and anywho so I, I was really people. i was really fascinated by this and i uh, wandered around but then when i came back to it i found the entire mandolin quartet had rolled in and i was there and we were there and we were all locked out of the church <laughs> <laughs> so i guess i should have hung in there and um fought the good fight against this woman um mm-hmm. because surely being locked out of the church that we were supposed to have access to was a sign from jesus that he was clearly caucasian and um Maybe he just doesn't like mandolin. Maybe he just doesn't like mandolin. <laughs> it's more, he's more of a banjo <laughs> banjo was, guy. Yeah, I think I think he was sitting up there on the on the cross and he was like, "Well, if she was meant to play that instrument, it would have been a womandolin. I, my father would have called it a womandolin." Is that funny? This is getting really off the rails. I should really stop. Um, anyways, it was a really beautiful shoot, and um, Bolton Hill in the spring is actually quite lovely. Um, and everything did turn out okay, and we got a wonderful recording, and it was really lovely, and um, everything's fine. And I hope that woman comes to terms with the changes in her life because she needs to get the fuck over it. Um, <laughs> uh, Jack asks, where's Prince? He's... Uh... I believe he's retired to his second level nap, which usually, I don't know, he has like a system and then he doesn't have a system, but he's he's upstairs sleeping. He was very pleased with his new window perch that I bought him, so he was on that most of the day. Uh, yeah, I'd bought one of those years ago, a suction cup thing. It did not hold his chunkiness, but... Uh, found a better one. Actually, don't feel angsty for a moment. Okay. To outrun my lonesome ways I'm gonna take this extra rib I got I'm gonna bury it Down in the dust she does not raise Dust she does not raise Cause I need a woman You're like Achilles Take this bronze star heart I got I'm gonna melt it down I'll wait for love to cast it into bone I have new eyes Son of a hurricane I spin you so sweetly Round and round and round But be careful, you know Atlanta never looked the same Till it burned to the ground a woman a heel like Achilles so I know there's always one way I can win love is cautious love is blind let's be honest now love is a catalog of deadly sins I need a woman with a, a chin like old Joe Frazier to step inside when I am swinging at the wind Exactly where I've been. I am the blue eyes, son of a hurricane. I spin you so sweetly round, round, round. But be careful, you know Atlanta never looked the same after she burned to the ground. After she burned down.
I need a woman Hands like John Henry's Are strong enough to break that rock down into sand When we die, we'll lay down side by side With our hammers in our hands And I need a woman With a heart like Secretariat I want my lonesome way yeah. I'm gonna take this extra real bag out I'm gonna bury it I'm down in the dust she does not freeze You too. Did you have our Heather Aubrey Lloyd? Yeah. We miss you too, Susan. Oh, we miss our Heather too. Yeah. I'm gonna send that woman back. Yep. We envy Heather for her trip for many reasons, but also because she gets to see you. <laughs> I'm sort of in well, love with that sentence. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Rude. <laughs> Come on, it was probably the last little nice, the, the last niceness, a nice man kiss before. <laughs> Before being carted off. Oh dear. Well, woman. Yes. Let's discuss that womanness. Uh oh. My woman. Womanness. Is that alright? So, after, after we spend our time with you, we're gonna watch Fallout. And I'm very excited about this, but I'm afeared because God damn, have you seen how they're making the door open in the trailer? And let's not even discuss how they get into the power armor. So maybe the story will be great, but those two animations are wrong. I don't have strong feelings because, as you will hear in this song, she don't even care about Fallout Foe. So I, I, have, no, I have no background. I'll appreciate the show for what it is. I'm going to have a good time anyways. Yeah. My woman, she likes to tug on my beard She says it helps keep a handle on me And I can see that As long as she's gentle I'm a delicate thing I only like the rough and tumble When it's time to come and level up for the occasion So I'd say that when I need some direction My woman, she can tug hard on my beard I say to myself How'd I get so lucky? My friends, they all say, man you get so lucky Well, with life I kiss the dice And I rolled a natural 20 I swear I have not hit that harmonic in weeks What the hell? Fucking Fred is moved My woman, she likes to drive My woman, she likes the sci-fi My woman drove us around 695 and down 29 To see Star Wars eight or nine times And she's got her rage She's got opinions on lanes and ran porks We blasted past soccer moms and swerving husbands And we were screaming That's not how the force works so I say to myself How'd I get so lucky? My friends, they all say that How'd you get so lucky? Well, if I if I kiss the dice Natural 20. A woman, she's a 
independent, kind of worried about singing my woman when she finally hears this. She's either gonna love it or she's gonna hate it. If she hates it, no one else will ever, 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 ever hear this. Maybe if I gave her a solo. Not one more of those pits parts that she hates, but with her bow. Oh. So by way of preemptive apology for accepted song forms with possessive terminology, here we go with Kristen Jones on the electric cello. <laughs> No psychodrama, well, Scrabble, yes, paranoia, no. She don't even care about Fallout Foe. She just don't play those games. So I say to myself, how'd I get so lucky? My friends, they all say, man, how'd you get so lucky? Now in life, I kiss the dice. Roll a natural 20. Roll a natural 20. That's what I meant to do last Man, week. But Seth, <laughs> Seth did not come with you. <laughs> it was have it was fun having him play on that song. He learned the Sharif licks on clarinet. Yeah. That was um that was like an aggressive version. <laughs> That's not aggressive. Sassy. Yeah, okay. Sassy. It was sassy. I'm having a sassy, sassy. day. We are having a sa- sassy day. <sighs> For those of you not in the know, self-employment tax, different from federal tax, operates differently. Hmm. Can't take the same deductions. Guess I should. Maybe. Well, it's not that it's a deduction; it's a credit. And the credit functions differently. Uh, bah. Uh. <laughs> and yet, despite that, I am a believer in paying your fair share. I am glad that I have relatively clean water and air that's better than it could have been and you know a road and and schools not for us but for the future the generations yes. who will be because look at that we care yes. about people other than ourselves sometimes <laughs> uh. live stream and moral lessons sorry, sorry. with Illy Amy <laughs> <I> <laughs> <meant> was, <laughs> we've had an, a, a difficult math day um, <laughs> paypal.me slash Illy Amy or Venmo at Illy Amy um, with the important part of us, the, the important thing for us to remember is that if we didn't make a living, we wouldn't have to pay taxes. True. This is true. <laughs> huh, Vaughn? I'd be curious to see like why why you're offset like that. Hmm. Yeah, we had people ask us, uh, well, are you an LLC? We, we've thought about doing that. It's it's complicated. <laughs> oh, S-Corp. Okay, gotcha. Yeah. Yeah, yeah I, 
I'm bad about like always addressing. I know, like you know, using incomplete sentences. Um, but I really appreciate our conversations, our weird multi-threaded conversations with the um, the multi-headed hydra that is our wonderful Ilyani audience out there. Thank you know, you so we're much. talking about Jesus and taxes mm. and two great tastes, two great tastes. <laughs> yeah, and I think it's important to put it in context. Um, yeah. you know, uh, what hell is other people? And thank goodness there's a there's at least some semblance of an operational government so that I don't actually have to face that hell all the time and all by myself. Uh, you know, it ain't perfect, but it sure is better than me facing literally the world all alone. <laughs> um, that's a more complicated thought than the sentence that just came out of my mouth. But Absolutely unrelated. Well, do our taxes pay for the mark? They, they might. Well, they subsidize it. Yeah. Uh, but my point was that my uh, my gimbal is actually called an S corp, which they 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 mark it as scorp, but it's actually S hyphen corp. Uh. Neither here nor there. <laughs> Here's a song that has absolutely nothing to do with the fact that I'm going to des- uh, dedicate it to the idea of sometimes paying for stuff that doesn't immediately benefit you, like a train that goes someplace that you're never going to go. Though you're going to New York with your guitar, or are you going off alone? Are you meeting someone where you think of me when you get there? Or do you think of me at all these days? This train will take you farther than I dare go. You're just outside my head. It's 600 miles of there, it's a long drive by anyone's standards, and I can't guarantee too many visits, and I can't guarantee too many letters. This station has a thousand tracks, and we are separate paths, are separate paths now. Know that I am hard to love. Know that I ask for far too much. But we get what we ask for sometimes, and sometimes we miss the mark. We miss the mark. Travel alone with my guitar, but I remain just a bit alone. Sometimes I meet someone I think of, no one some days, but sometimes someone's just enough. It's really fill my time. Sometimes even a dream's not enough. Sometimes even a dream is too late. I miss the mark. <laughs> Chris Auto Music. I am also <laughs> ordained, which means that oh, yeah. I have definitely looked into the idea of, you know, I, I, I gather my flock at least weekly, um, and the idea of the Church of Rob's Soap and Mics <laughs> yeah. is totally freaking legal, but I, I think that maybe I don't want to... I don't think we want to get anywhere near a, a super pack. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, no. <laughs> <laughs> But, you know, we'll see what we could do with that. 
Hello, Rick. Nice, Robustiano. Nice. Oh, oh, sorry, sorry. <laughs> go ahead to where you were, Rick. Oh, oh just God, saying. I'm pressing the first, wrong button. There we go. I'm first, at that one. First time there greetings. I feel like I saw a, a Facebook comment earlier from mm, from cool. Rick, but welcome, welcome, mm, welcome, welcome, welcome indeed. Um, Robustiano. Hey, man, I'm not going to judge your amazingly excellent taste. I hope that you're having a good time. Are you in season two yet? Like where we're sort of like, why did we have to go with the searcher? Man, I miss Earth or not. Um, but yeah, yeah. season two kind of takes a turn. Yeah, it does. Yeah. It starts weird. Yeah. It gets weirder. <laughs> Neither here nor there. Uh. Hmm. I'll have to check that out. I'm not familiar with that. Tell us where you're coming in from. And welcome, welcome all. Seeing shades of gray again. I never seen the reds that you've seen. You rub this into me most every day, and I'm as crimson just the same. Inside your head, it keeps you warm inside like alcohol. Yeah. I never understood that one all too well. It's just another pill for the common man. There's nothing there to dull down the pain I feel. Three long days at least. That's enough time for your son of resurrection. Whoever comes to fill your next prescription, they're gonna be a brand new man. Step in front of trains Just to feel the pain of rattle As I step back I range These new bullet trains I got what I got in my mind Too much speed to get away Again, I am armed and armored flannel tooth and guarded. I set my blade to earth six long years ago, and today it's a sin I know to penetrate and I never stop to get his name. Well, there's nothing there to tell down the noise I fear. Keep me from thinking of his face. He did enough to get me through those rough, rough spots, but I'm gonna take every pill that I can take. Jersey walls, they got no sense of humor after all play games of guard rails in the night. I can't think straight, so I'm just gonna drive so straight, keep my eyes closed.
to let your blood rest in its tubes. Mixed right with your chemistry, it closes the mind straight eye you will see, drives the juices from your head. Seeing with the mind's eye, it's got its price to pay. Closing it has a cost again. If that thought of cost that you think you can meet just quite yet, well, we'll meet again this time next week. No, I step in front of trains, just a few the main of battle as I step back a rain. These new bullet trains, I got what I got in my mind. Too much speed to get away. Jersey walls, they got no sense of humor out there. They get to guardrails in the night. I can't think straight, so I'm just gonna try and soar straight. Keep my eyes closed to the all. How much longer before we get to call you Baltimore? Hmm? Um, I heard about yeah, that. Yeah, yeah. Rick Worth out there needing a new nickname. <laughs> I'm so curious. I feel like I wish I'd become prepared for this eventuality. Like some sort of form that I could have sent out and been like, well, please fill up this form that gives us distinctive traits about you so that we can come up with something that's name adjacent but also pertinent to your character. Um, yeah. And I, I guess, gosh, I don't know Rick Worth. And I guess... Yeah, well, he's in the he's Santa Barbara area. That, Santa Barbara, that's California, yeah. right? Yes. Okay, cool. Yeah. <laughs> West Coast. I visited there once. Okay. Um, I had gone to the NAM show in Anaheim uh, Music Retail Conference for House Music. I think this was like right before I met you. Before us. Yes. And then I had a friend in Santa Barbara, and I was like, I'm going to take the train from... Anaheim to Santa Barbara, and I was amazed that it was like at the time I don't know it was like under thirty dollars to oh, go there. Where like, like our mark on the East Coast. Well, sort of, yeah, but like going the same distance from like DC to New York costs oh, like a hundred dollars. So well, anyway, it was go. it was a nice Amtrak journey along the coast. We went to like some wine wineries places. Nice area. Hmm. Anyway. I've been there. Yeah, I don't think I've, t- <laughs> I've toured through that area. Yeah. Um, our touring through California has been very, very, usually very swift mm-hmm. because there's something about like, you know, touring out, making an 11 or 12 week tour and realizing you've got to, you know, you got to get all the way out there. You got to go away all the way back. Um, and California is a huge state. And California is a really huge state. And so that you're sort of, of like, well, you know what? Let's pick two dates and hope for the best. Yep. Um, and usually those dates have centered around Redwoods, which is not a really excellent place to play music for others but it is a really lovely place to just play yeah um that's neither here nor there Hmm. santa barbara rickworth (laughs) that sounds like a department store have you been to the rickworths at santa barbara (laughs) yes it's fantastic they have fabulous summer deals on furniture and tea cozies Mm, tea Mm. cozies yeah (laughs) well that's what i hear they sell at the santa barbara rickworths Rick, we'll, we're weird. We'll, we'll get weird at you. That's, that's what we do. <laughs> okay, cool. A couple months for Tracy until she's closer to us. That's exciting. It was so good to see you and your pooch this past weekend. That was fun. <laughs> hmm. California. I know we play this a lot. Yeah. But it just keeps being relevant. Compilation. Like you're on a you're on a compilation or you Oh, Rick Worth, were you um are you a member of a band that I had checked out? Is that why your name seems familiar? Um drop a link to who and what mm. you be if mm. if you want to do that. Congratulations. California's. I think that's a typo, but I kind of am into the idea of states having man exports. <laughs> <laughs> man 
manly tea cozies. <laughs> well, I get that. I used to be a bass player in a heavy metal cover band that branched out into a lot of different random things. I pretend to be a bass player in an old-timey band. Started as a bass player in a, in a, a reggae band. Red Zion. I'm not proud. Andy Latrell joins us sometimes from up in uh, New England, wherever he's at, and he was he was the mastermind behind that disaster. <laughs> Spent my days with a woman unkind She smoked all my stuff and drank Every bit of my wine I made up my mind to make a new start I'm going to California with a bacon Someone told me there's a woman out there with love in her eyes and flowers in her hair. steps of dawn. I'm trying to find a woman who's never, ever, ever born. Standing on a hill in my mountain of dreams. I'm telling myself it's not as hard, hard as it seems. your freak out pedal that does that no it's all natural yeah it's my freak out pedal we had some freak out thanks jack feedback. thanks <laughs> thank y'all for hanging out with us next week we have guest again we're gonna have uh, jeff miller back in the house who has been with us a few times now 
Um, he's touring through, he's going to be at uh, the feature next week, right? At Europe and Mike on Tuesday and with us. And then I want to say he's playing New, New Deal, Deal yeah. next Thursday. So. <laughs> Thank you, Tracy. I do not know what this acronym is. Lovingly, um, but they stay to suck the joy from him. Uh. They suck it down, suck it down, suck it down. The way you finish fruit, it always leaves you hungry. It's one more toy for the poor hate, one more way to make him pay for all these things that he will never be. stronger she's beaten back she's beaten up she's fighting back she's fucking up she needs that tool and she needs it now here's to an educated labor some help from alcohol she don't need no time to hold it she just needs to make it Have a nice night. It's one more toy to break. That thing is always screaming. The telephone is off the hook with predators and debitors and people with their dark hanging knees. We'll keep it down, keep it down, keep it down. Wrapped in plastic, precious plastic. Let the water keep you down. Back on the run I never thought a boy so young could have it I 
I never thought a boy could be so dumb No, you can do those things in seven seconds Knowing no one ever, never needed either human lives We take a step and jack one in And check the mirror and shoot again And shoot again and shoot again I think revolution is the answer Yeah, life is all your mind Sides I got the ammo On both sides I got the right Take it to me by street Just like a lover Every man is an oppressor Every man is just a soldier Like a soul for peace, man Just the fight I've always dreamed Fights I've always dreamed of I was born to be some star In the ring to save this world Sorry, I'm, I'm sorry, I, I, you ever had to see me fall? Choke Cherry. I haven't done that in a while. Joey rung that out of me the other night at an open mic. Um, all right, all right. Okay. Have a good night, Jack. Thank you for, for yeah, being thanks, with Jack. us. Thanks, Jack. Thanks for being with us like every freaking webcast. <laughs> I appreciate it. So we're webcasting live from our lair, live from the lair. We do this every Wednesday night, 7 p.m. ET. Whatever time that was in California, whatever time it is in Australia, you guys have figured it out by now, and that makes me happy because um, I don't want to do the math. And um, I guess this is for a uh, this is this is for live music. This is for live music. <laughs> all up in your space, all up in your space. <laughs> I don't know the 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 Illy Wee camera is like all up in your what space the the, the Illy your your tablet camera. Oh. If you did that view, that would be all up in your space. Yeah, look up Rob's nose a little bit. Yeah. Why, why would you just, just think? <laughs> <laughs> I'm missing the camera. I didn't, why would you even? Why would you even? <laughs> See how I feel about E flat minor tonight. Stains and traces all down your side. I sketch spirals as you sleep. I start on the bed and work my way in. I 
by request they may run and smudge I've always left mud most everywhere that I have touched Place my hand to your skin right in Start all over again To answer uh, our Australia friend's question, um, yeah, I learned on a regular size cello, although when I started as a wee one, it was a half size and then a three quarter size and then a full size. Um, but yeah, if I had had this when I was a student, especially learning to play in the, the upper positions where it's scary on full size cello because you have to like lift your arm up and go, and this one is just zoop and there's dots on the fingerboard that tell you where to play that's awesome <laughs> so yeah they they have their their advantages lighter 
Thank you so much, Vaughn. It, I mean, we're just thrilled that people are still tuning in and, and folks who have been watching since the beginning, like like you, um, yeah, and we get to see you every week, even though we don't get to see you visually. It's, it's pretty awesome. Thank you. But as long as people are listening, we'll, we'll keep doing this. That's a good spine song. Spine. Oops. Ah. <laughs> Laura Lee, thank you. <laughs> Yeah, I mean, some, you know, the traditional classical people, some of them are still like, oh my God, what is that? No, we don't, we don't do that. But there are, there's actually some schools that are buying these instruments and having like an electric program. Um, I have the courage of someone to play. I know. There's another calming one for Tracy. Thank you. 
Thank you. Hey, Joe. Crystal, you did miss natural 20. I don't know if we'll do a repeat tonight, but uh, it'll, it'll be on the replay if you want to go back. <laughs> Thank you so much. I'm excited to at some point have the recorded version of that out. There's some cool, cool Sharif stuff happening on that. Maybe some stuff that hasn't happened yet. <laughs> Rob's in a wah, a wah Sorry, mood. What did, what did I say? Oh, hey, Joe. Yeah. Hey, Joe Isaacs. <laughs> Joe requested this the other night. Mm. Mm. Australia, that's because we are easily bored. <laughs> <laughs> I don't think we're bored. We just like we just like a lot of different stuff. We like a lot of different stuff. Yeah. yeah. The view it is just fine from here. You can't see the mountain from the top anyway. It doesn't have to go and be this way, but I'm halfway there on any day, anyway. Said it loud enough. Breaking glass, an emergency, a stolen faith, a box with blade, courage, and a shotgun town. Better felt good to feel down on the rack and on the cheap. Break a midnight, take a week, but at best, the best buttons always make you bleed. Living just a cold scar for your feet.
didn't breathe it out, I just got winded. Stretch, rest, and hail, stretch, flex, exhale, in and out, in and out, just get out. I've always been apologetic, taking pride in higher ground. But looking down and looking round and lift another up, well, it all starts with looking down. It all starts with looking down. playing that with the full band on May the 4th in Fairfax, Virginia at Earp's Ordinary Big Star Wars Day show. Um, for you folks in our localish area, I'm going to put the link in the comments where you can get tickets for that. It's a ticketed show, but it's, it's very affordable. Um, if you have not been to Earp's, it's a nice... Um, Music venue, actual music venue. Come out, come out and support, please do. Yeah. Um, Erps is in that uncomfortable place between black hole and the sun. No, uh, it's this really uncomfortable place, which we've seen a lot of venues hit, where it frankly took a lot more to get them opened than than they thought it was going to take. Um, they were coming out of COVID. I mean, they were delayed for three or four years by COVID. Um, they were expecting to open right at the beginning of COVID, and that mm. sure didn't happen. And yeah. I think they just opened um, late last year, I guess. And uh, and they are going through that process that so many amazing venues have gone through where they're like, we're going to go out there, and we're going to support live original music, and we're going to pay the bands well, and we're going to have a high production value, and you know, we have smoke machines and lights and a stage and great sound and all this stuff. And then they run full tilt into the realities of... Um, of live original music, which is that it can be hard to get people out. So please tell your friends, come out and support that show and support that venue because they're 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 fighting the good fight, but they're slipping and they're beginning to have to book those cover bands on the weekends. And yeah. at the moment, I think we may be the only original music booked on a weekend. Oh, really? Um, wow. And and they've they've had to, you know, but that was because I got in there real early. Yeah. Yep. Um. So please come out. It's a Saturday night and it's a f it's a cool venue. Um, and they have really good hot chicken sandwiches um, and other things. It's the same menu as. Have you been to the other? No. Oh no, man, you like their tacos. Yeah. They Somebody have, said like, a Euro shrimp. Tacos. A shrimp thing was really good. A shrimp thing is really know. good. Well, There's really good food. Yeah. But man, why do I have to sell you on the food? Come and <laughs> come come to the music. It, it's it's gonna be a great night. Yeah. May the fourth. May the fourth. Chewbacca sighting. Um, do we have a Chewbacca down here? We have one upstairs. Chewbacca's upstairs. Maybe there's a Chewbacca in Australia. He's hanging out with. <laughs> so that, was a, that was a bizarre, like one-two punch of like strangeness right there. Oh, I meant, I meant <laughs> Chewbacca sighting. I mean, original music. Go original music. <laughs> I mean, it, it will be Star Wars Day, so we're probably there. We go. Maybe there will be, be a Chewbacca. Some... I don't even know what's happening There's... in my own mind. <laughs> Um, geez, uh, what do you want to play? I'm, I'm, no, yeah. I'm, my brain is getting yeah. kind of dead. Yeah. Um, but, 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 uh, terms in your head or not really? Yeah, yeah. Okay. I, I'm, for as much as anything has been in my head this evening, you know? <laughs> 
Is this this? Yes. This song was in my head today because we were doing our taxes. Support us in doing our taxes, please. PayPal.me slash Iliami or Venmo at Iliami. The more you give, the more we get to pay at the end of the year. But I mean, that's not the that's not a selling point. What I meant to say was support, your donation support the arts. is not tax deductible, but it supports the arts. <laughs> Crystal will hit that next. I've been hitting at five like an amateur. Showing my age with my subject and glances and my choices and logos and pants. Just now that I got skin in the game and I've been screaming my loudest with the rest of them. Yeah, screaming my loudest with the rest of them. I'm still waiting on the roads and the potholes and patches No one else gets it, we got skin in the game You all just duck and blame all the rest of them it's joking, but at least they got coverage And California is burning, but at least they still got insurance Volkswagen's grinning, but at least it's deductible They just pay up and smile like the rest of them They pay up and smile like the rest of them only gets you so far just found out i got skin in the game and i've been playing my little heart out for hours i'm waiting by the phone and the road and the courthouse i'm waiting on the phone now with saints and with greatness we all found out we got skin in the game but it sure seems like nobody gets it of us and I can't wait till you figure out why I'm hoping that you'll soon get as sore as the rest of us and then I'm thinking that you'll figure out why I'm showing my age with my first person negative I just thought I'd something to say and turns out I'm just a product of all of you people and I guess that sort of makes us the same yes, that sort of makes us the same you sit back and laugh.
haven't paid that played that one for a while. But that should it's political season. It's definitely time for that to come back because that was written for everyone the last time we were about to have an election and the newspapers were like, ha, 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 ha. Isn't it funny this man named Trump is running? Whoa, how amusing. We'll give him lots of airtime. Though there's no possibility that he could possibly ever win unless someone gave him lots of free air. Oh. So anyways, that's what that song is about. <clears throat> what I meant to say was, let's play Elephant Joke. Okay. Paul, it, it really it really does because he, he has special prescription food, so, you know. <laughs> Decide that his Instagram had caught enough traction yet that we can deduct it. No, no, no. Okay, no. no. <laughs> I occasionally get those like brand messages, like, "Do you want to partner with us? You're so cute." But they're spammy. They're they're not actually offering my cat sponsorships. It would also just really suck if, like, they sent us free food and he was like, this is crap. <laughs> <sighs> We're like, sorry, we really can't, in good conscience, yeah. sponsor this. So, um, <laughs> showing my age with my subjects and glances, my choices and logos and pants line was very much a product of um, judging people in skinny jeans and thinking, Meh, but then feeling like that showed my age because I, you know, thought that was not cool. And... Um, and having had to design a couple of logos right in a row, and I went for circles and blue, and then I looked at that and I was like, man, that is a product of the late 90s, early 2000s when everything was a circle in blue. But that has been fortunately coming around again. Um, and apparently skinny I mean, jeans are out square. now, at least for women. I don't know about men, but it's... Hot package pads. You know. I think that's what they're also called. Everything them. just comes around and leaves and... Yeah. I'm not sure if mom jeans are still in. Oh, I thought she was talking about my cat for a sec. I was like, I, that's what not I sending too, the cat to Australia. Yeah. He's not a ca- <laughs> Oh, oh. Um, I mean, I feel like... It, but no, I'm, I'm just not going <laughs> to get that, that conversation. There's just too much to say. <laughs> you know, it would be amazing if he fell into that category at some point. How does this song go? Oh, yeah. Ah, that's a cool riff. Who wrote that? Oh, me. But it starts off with something else. (laughs) Sorry, my brain is my brain is really ready to watch Fallout. Is I think what part of the problem? Side blind side wasn't the right side for me. Just cause I've done something for you uh, doesn't mean you got anything, anything for me. And falling through the cracks with no safety net at all. Makes the cheap seats even cheaper and a sure sharper, sharper, sharper will fall. Why did any of this mean? Gonna save me. Got me grief. I want to look something in this room. Never cold and never hungry, just stay huddled close to me. I'm the sum of every little thing you need. Or in huddled masses, turning to be me. You have nothing left to fear, but fear itself in me. Why did any of this Master. 
a ship that stands and asks askance if you thought you'd know everything else here has changed. It's been known to turn the line of place that's made upon the scales. It's been known to slowly shift around. It's known to tell the joke and call the shots and pull the strings. And everybody knows it really gets around. What did any of this mean? What's gonna save me now? Some elephant joke for y'all. Going for the bear tone. I was thinking we're probably like nearing the end, but hmm. see what you want to do there. Thank you, Joe. Heather's going to be back soon. She's winging her way eastward. Maybe maybe we'll have her one Hartford of these. On Friday. Yeah, Hartford Vineyard and um, up there in Maryland. Good job, <laughs> Har <dear>. Hartford County, <laughs> wherever that is. <laughs> oh. Here's another song from the last election that I was hoping not to use again. Give them damn it. Sorry, okay, we're, we're clear. We're here. We're Rob and um, Steer. Yeah. We'll never give them time to think, make them answer quick. Shine I'm bright white light in their face You know only liars never take time to think Never give them cash Cousin God we trust If they do you best keep their change Your self-made man wouldn't ever need it Never give them anything That'll make them work Best intentions, that's a white man's perk. Tells me building something, a Walmart down on the crossroads. The devil he gave us Mexico. Build a big wall to keep him down in his hole, and that wall is built for demons. Animals and thugs. Sure, ain't built for people, man. You walk 4,000 miles and walk won't even slow you down. We never gave them anything. They had to get to work. These idle hands and best intentions. That's a white man's perk. A different brand of martyr People down on their knees They're not praying for redemption They're praying we'll let them breathe
savior. He promised bright white cities filled with gold. Now there's fresh paint on blood in Washington. Glistening and yellow in the middle of the road. And I don't buy your God can't hear you. Just cause you can't get into church. Though I guess it is the devil who promises knowledge. Omnipresent really is quite a very, very, very long word. And I can see these signs from heaven. Along with everything we've done, I can live with most of my decisions, man. I think you're gonna burn for this one. We never gave them anything. They had to get to work. Cause idle hands and best intentions. That's a white man's perk. Down on their knees I think we're way past redemption We're going to let them breathe mythologize your own youth I think in a lot of ways and you make up a lot of tales and legends that you hit, fit your own head into um, and uh, someone posted my fourth grade yearbook online recently <laughs> which was a sh shock <laughs> but one of the things that was fascinating was looking at that page and being like okay I'm not making it up I grew up in a very legitimately very, very racially diverse yeah. environment, and, and that very, very much shaped my beliefs and thinking in, in the idea that, like, you know, monoculture is just bad for us. Um, and uh, PG County, you have a lot of faults, <laughs> but uh, that was a beautiful place to grow up because... It was very different from my experience. Yeah. yeah. Like, the first time I ever met a black person was at a uh, summer camp in another state. Like, it was not... Yeah. Backing away from anything about, like, demographics or cultural experiences and experiencing other people and diversity on that front, if nothing else, damn, our yearbook photographer had to use very different exposures. Um and that's good for you as a photographer. <laughs> so well done, photographer, because, man, I've seen some other yearbook photos where it's like, oh, there was that one black kid, and it's just like a shadow on the page. That's just sad. That person did not understand how to capture their audience. That's not a here nor there. <laughs> Sorry. Sorry. Sorry, man. <laughs> we're, we're near. It's like, if nothing else, come on. At least, you know, Variety in demographics allows you to learn how to use your damn camera. You can't just leave that shit on auto when it was all programmed by white people. Uh, yeah. That's neither here nor there either. Can you say that? You think so? You think so? I think so too. Just how much I can sympathize with the fallacy of compromise and knowing when to do. Who's in, who's out? You gotta learn just when to bail out. This deep. 
here has been the exercise And I'm all worn out Wish there was a pill Take it quick and never feel ill Fall in line Dry swallow too and never beat the bill I, I wish there was a pill Take it quick and never question it It's the medicine man It's the cure for me Over something size, swearing everyone's a liar. Breathe in, breathe out, breathe in, breathe out. You gotta know what it is, what it's all about. This year has been the exercise. I'm all worn out. I wish there was a pill. Take it quick and never feel ill. Fall in line, dry spot or two, and never be the bill. I, I wish there was a pill. Take it quick and never question it It's the medicine man It's the cure for being an American We used to say I don't care what you look like I don't care what you make Wednesday night, we are live from the lair, and if you want to contribute to our continued existence, 
and our cat's chunkiness. PayPal.me slash Ilyami or Venmo at Ilyami. And for those artists out there, let me remind you that if you're looking for one last minute tax thing to do before April 15th, keep in mind that as artists to artists, this is research. This Ooh. is stuff that you're contributing towards okay. your local scene. So maybe your you donation write off is your, tax You can deductible. write off your donation to us yeah. if you're another musician. Okay. Um, you can be like, yeah, well, I was researching streaming techniques. That's totally legit. <laughs> Buying one another's CDs and albums and streaming music. For us, collective us, that's tax deductible right there. <laughs> I ain't a lion. So, so that is uh, Rob's Tacoma baritone. And it's funny, we've been re-watching Friends and uh, there is a smaller version of that guitar that appears on, uh, on Joey's, Joey's couch. couch. <laughs> and in Joey and Chandler's apartment, neither of them plays guitar that we know of. Yep. And yet they have a very nice Tacoma. Yep. Um, so, yeah. Anywho. We're going to... Is it nine yet? Yes. Yeah. yeah. So yep. that means Fallout has dropped, and I'm excited about that. Are you going to do this? <laughs> Just say goodnight. With a beautiful love song. And I don't want to set the world on fire. I just want to start this flame in your heart. <laughs> in my heart, I have but one desire. That one desire is you. No one else will do. I've lost all. Oh, oh no, it's like I've lost all ambition for worldly acclaim. I just want to be the one you think you love. Ooh, ooh, ooh. with your admission, do you feel the same? I'll be reaching the goal I'm dreaming of. Believe me, <laughs> this is terrible. <laughs> I don't want to set the world on fire. I've lost all ambition for worldly acclaim. I just want to be the one you love. Oh, with your admission that you feel the same, I'll be reaching the goal that I am dreaming of. Believe me, <laughs> that one desire is you. Something, something. <laughs> I love you. <laughs> I thought you were going to drop the curtain. I was going to do this okay. behind that. Like, so well, because once you drop the curtain, the, oh. then we can Because once weird. you drop the curtain, then, it, we, then we're free to be just weird, okay. right? Okay, I'm, I'm dropping the curtain. Okay. Yeah. Yeah. Uh, yeah. yeah, just pretend that just happened. <laughs> Maybe I'll fix it in post. I, I kind of doubt it, but... I mean, it could be worse. I could have been like, Hey, everybody, I got news. Put your Pete's back in town. He's hacking and whacking and smacking. He's hack. Yeah, and any of you who have never played Fallout, this is pretty alien to you right now. You're like, why the hell is this happening to me? Well, go go watch Fallout and find let's out. Go watch Fallout together and see what happens. I bet they're going to make none of those references, which <laughs> make me very sad. Plus, the door opens the wrong way. It's just pissing me off. But, you know, it is my right as a nerd to be pedantic. My right as a musician to express that pedantry, pet, pedant, pedant, pederast. No. Oh my God. <laughs> uh, we'll see you next week with Jeff Miller. We'll see you next week, Jeff Woo. Miller.